I grew up in an average family. Um, I'm a eldest of four siblings, or three siblings, two young men now, and a young lady. It, it's so much fun is involved, you know, when you're not the only child. Uh, growing up, it, uh, there's so much to do. As you age, uh, it also works in the sense that you become more of a uh, influence for your siblings so it sort of shaped the way I wanted my family to turn out to be not that I don't have four kids but I have two now so I think I'm just gonna park it there it's more of a, a, a lifestyle now than a hobby but I enjoy farming to a great extent it's what I spend most of my time on yeah I'm into small stock and large stock farming Doing small stock, I'm doing damara sheep, which are hardy animals. They're quite drought resistant. And I'm sort of mixing the genes with meat master, which carry a larger, broader body frame. So you have more meat on it for when you do now sell bigger weights. Uh, the cattle, I'm doing more guinea mixed with bonsmara, also gives a large body frame but because of the guinea the guinea part you have hardy resistant to droughts and stuff like that. So currently I'm in the space of information technology. My final year in school as uh, school was having a computer they were auctioning off old computers so having never touched the PC I decided okay let me influence or convince my parents to buy me a PC and since then to date, I've basically been hooked. That is how I got into, into IT. It plays a massive role, just, uh, not just work-wise, but um, for home use. I think in today's day and age, if you are disconnected from, from the internet, you are basically three, four days behind. So connectivity is a huge, huge aspect of, of our day-to-day -day business. Because most of my research, you know, if I have to, for example, if I'm on the farm and I want to find out what the effects of medication is, I can just quickly fire that up on my phone. If I'm at the office and I'm stuck with a problem, I can quickly fire up Google. And so it, it's such a huge necessity that one needs to have constant connectivity. Um, I think I would like to be remembered as somebody who tried. Um, uh, not really one that backs down from a challenge once I commit to it. And I think those are teachings that I think my direct um, benefactors should look at if I'm no longer here one day to say that these are traits that they would also like to carry forward. Thank you for having me.